Heracles. Hercules drawing. In this video lesson, you will learn how to draw a well-developed masculine figure of the Greek hero, Hercules. This marble statue is displayed in the Uffizi Gallery in Florence, Italy. It is one of the most famous depictions of Heracles, which is the Roman-era marble copy from the 2nd century AD, modeled after the now-lost bronze original by the famous sculptor Lysippos. I am standing in the famous Uffizi Gallery in front of the sculpture of Heracles, making a quick preliminary sketch to capture the figure's shape and proportions. Heracles, also known as Hercules, was a hero in Greek mythology. He was the son of Zeus and a symbol of strength, courage, ingenuity, and sexual prowess. He is known for the twelve labors of Heracles, after completion of which he joined the Argonauts in their quest for the Golden Fleece. According to the ancient story, at the age of 18, Heracles hunted an enormous lion and killed him. This is why in many sculptures and works of art, he is depicted with a lion's skin. As a symbol of masculinity, the Heracles sculpture is an ideal model to examine well-pronounced muscles in this video lesson. Heracles stands in the contrapposto position. However, he also rests on his club. Therefore, the vertical central line will not coincide with his center of gravity. The adductor group of muscles defines the outline of the upper half of the inner thigh. These muscles originate from the pelvis and run into the thigh bone. The calf muscles define the width of the lower leg. As you can see on this drawing, the inner portion of the calf muscle is slightly lower than the outer one. You should also be aware that the axis of the ankle bones also runs on a diagonal. The inner ankle is higher than the outer one. It is safe now to apply a bit more pressure on the red pencil, as no erasing will be required to correct the proportions we've already established. I will now mark the secondary details, like the lion's skin and the wooden club, which act as a support for the Heracles figure. It is time to apply some shading to reveal the tonal values of the model.